want to output to VR, you can do so by using the VR cam inside Houdini. There are a range of projection formats that are supported by different devices, so let's have a look. So here I have a destruction scene, which is fairly heavy, and I want to output this scene for VR. So I'm just going to hit the tab key, type VR cam, and hit the enter key to select it. There's my VR cam. Let me just set the camera view to the VR cam and click the lock button. And I'm going to just pan around the scene until I get the view that I want. Let me just change the shading to flat wire shaded. And now I want to see what my camera is pointing at in the render view. So let me just split my desktop. I'm going to hit Alt and close square bracket, and this will give me a horizontal split view. Red mouse button on the scene view and change that to render view. And I'm just going to flip it. So I have the scene view down below. Now let's choose the VR cam. And if you don't have a Mantra render up, just create one in the render menu and select Mantra or Mantra PBR. Here you can set your range and also your resolution. I'm going to keep it on the one third scale for the purpose of this video. All right, let's hit render. And there's our render from the VR cam. If we select the render cam, we can see that there is a VR tab and a number of options there. Under layout, we have some stereo options, left, right, left over, right under, and then individual eye output, left, right. And projection, we have flat long, the regular perspective, also cube map, NVIDIA, and 3x2, which will give you the six images that will be mapped onto a cube that creates the 360 panorama. And depending on which projection type you select, you can further tweak the field of view, clipping, distortion, and so on. And that's how you can output to VR using the VR cam inside Houdini.